Hey everybody, I'm Yvonne with Back to Earth Creations and welcome to this week's shop update, giveaway, and what's new. Uh, we will be starting off with our giveaway, which is completely free to participate in. We only announce the winners here in the video, never down in the comments. So if somebody's doing that, that's a scammer. Um, but the way to have participated will have been to have left a comment on last week's shop update giveaway and what's new video um, And that will put your name in the hat for this one And so let's go ahead and get the camera flipped around and see who is this week's winner winner chicken dinner and also the winnings that we're giving away are One of our booty boxes You can't see it, but it's all full of like really nice crafty stuff um, <laughs> um, <laughs> I need to get out more um yeah let's go ahead and get the camera flipped around you can participate if you live outside of the United States but you get our digital download content so like our written jewelry tutorials our leather templates and different things like that um instead of having your winnings be shipped to you and again just to be clear we will never announce it down in the comments and you don't pay for anything it is completely free so if anybody even if they have their little like a uh, channel icon if they're asking for you to like text them a whatsapp number or pay for shipping or anything like that no that's a scam i'm sorry but that being said let's go and see who this week's winner winner chicken dinner is Alrighty, so this week we have 99 unique commenters. So thank you to everybody who has participated. We are going to click the start button and see who wins. So prepare the drum roll. Woo! Congratulations to Deanna Marsala. Ah! Deanna says, oh my god, I just love the agate cap. <laughs> and a bunch of emojis and then much love oh well thank you so much Deanna and congratulations on being this week's winner winner chicken dinner Deanna if you could send me an email to back to earth creations at yahoo.com with where you would like for me to ship your winnings to we will go ahead and get your booty box sent out to you so and we typically we typically ship out on Mondays so that's always something good to keep in mind so now let's see what is in this week's shop update. Alrighty, so we um, this is our new tray of inventory for this week of handmade cabochons as well as some gemstone cabochons uh, new to the shop this week. But we also have all sorts of other uh, gemstone infused glass and dichroic glass cabochons up for sale at backtoearthcreations.com as well as um, our different like monthly kits and um, some leather goods and some handmade beads and some unique handmade jewelry and all sorts of stuff. So this is just what's new this week, but if you head on over to backtoearthcreations.com, you may find something in addition to this that might catch your eye. So we have a bunch of very pretty opalite. Here are our dichroic glass, which like, I just love the subtle opal-like flashes of these Fritz-style dichro cabs. But then again, I'm also like always a huge fan of these crinkle style and then just the beautiful electric purple here in this one i love the marbling in the howlite this one <laughs> oh i love it oh and then ooh, this one might be one of my favorites but yeah it's just a pretty short quick shop update update video this week um we do have some new bead styles that i don't currently have cleaned and ready to show you on camera but if you check out the website we do have a couple of new bead styles up there i know we're so professional <laughs> i should totally let me go grab them even though they're like not cleaned yet i'm gonna go grab them okay so <laughs> Some of the, let's see, we have some that I was just having fun with because I never did get around. I'm so sorry, y'all. During Tuesday's live stream, I was um, hoping, I was aiming at doing a un, an Unload the Kiln with me video and then it just didn't happen. We had some stuff come up and it just kept getting pushed to a back burner. But we've got some of these styles doing, making custom work for folks. And I had done, done two different styles, like the same color, but one of them had the butternut stringer and the other one has the black filigrana stringer wrapped around it. And so those were a lot of fun to make. Ooh, look at this little guy. He's so cute. I love those gravity swirl beads. 
And then let's see. Here's one. That was one of the new ones that we had made. And I'm really, really pleased because what needs done on these is they still have the bead release there on the inside. So they're just in here soaking and then we're going to use the Dremel to clean those out. But let's see. Um, Ooh, I was doing some example beads. There's one of them. That one was a little gutters. Here we go. So, and I'm putting together a video, y'all, on some of the different nuanced var variations that we can do with our beads. So I don't know if you're able to tell, but here we have, this is a dark teal core with a pale purple dot. Now on here, you cannot see the purple like at all, but you can tell where it should have been because of where the dot is. Now, like the little uh, air bubble that's trapped in there, which I think is super cool. Like I kind of love just putting air bubbles in them. Um, we're gonna have to play more with that later. But here is the same exact bead, like the same sequence, but I did a dot of white underneath the pale purple. So whenever you're ordering your custom beads, with no additional cost, you could get this bead, or based on how you request, you could get this bead, which has a white core that we've encased in the dark teal, which I'm gonna pop that one back in there. Again, both of these same core color, but you can see how much it lightened it up to have that white opaque uh, glass in the center. And then both of these have the dot of white underneath the light purple. Um, so the only difference between these two beads was that this one has that core. So um, we've added those variation options to the website. Oh, here they are. I found them. Which is, a, this is another one that's just super cute. Like, look at that little bead. So, um, which this one, it kind of pulled some of the white bead dot up with it. I'm trying really hard to not get my band-aid wet, but here I am. Um... But yeah, so here's another one of our equator dot bubble beads, which is an option to be added to the website. Um, by the time this video is published, that should be um, an option that's up on, on there. And then we have these ones that are the little, like, uh, I don't know what to call them, but we do dots and then I, like, drag um, a tungsten pick through it while it's still molten. And these are a whole lot of fun and you can pick um, your core color and then your bead color and then... I do the bloop where I pull it through and oh y'all they're so pretty and they are so fun I guess maybe a chevron I don't know we'll see um what else do I have in here uh I don't know just a whole ooh, is this the one y'all this was my very first attempt at making little flowers and it's not I'm gonna be honest it's not very good but it's not the worst it could have been either see like that one came out ish like pretty pretty ish <laughs> so I'm I'm really really excited to keep experimenting with making beads so some of these sets will be listed up to the website next week but I was making some example settings or uh, example batches of will have where you can order a set of three beads in a pre-established size um where it's like a pendant and earring set or earring sets themselves like these were two that I was like let's make these the same size and then we're going to list them up as an earring set on the website where you can choose your it's a pre-established size of bead that I recommend for like you know it just typically makes a pretty good earring um, but you can pick your bead style and then your colors um, so we'll get that figured out um, but yeah, so those are, those are our beads so far. So other than that, that's kind of, that's what we've got going on this week for our shop update. Um, be sure to use coupon code happy crafter with no punctuation or spaces or anything, um, to get 10% off of your order. I think it's like really bright outside. Like, um, I can, I can deal with it. We'll just turn this away. Ah, there we go. Okay. Um, <laughs> Coupon code Happy Crafter will get you 10% off of your order. Or if you're in our Happy Crafter Club, keep an eye out for that email that we send every Monday um, with like all the links to everything. And then also we give first dibs on Patreon and our YouTube channel members, and you get that 20% off coupon in those posts as well. So we're still kind of 
we're t t we're through most of the transition into the new website and the new email and stuff so we're but we're still trying to like tidy up the loose ends like we're on the finishing end of that so if y'all have any questions about anything or any complications with like logging in or anything like that send us an email to back to earth creations at yahoo.com and we'll, we'll try our best to be helpful to you and get it sorted out a lot of the times we don't know if something's an issue or being problematic um like on our website until somebody lets us know so thank you to everybody who's given us so much valuable feedback um so that's the website we are gearing up for <gasps> anime st louis towards the end of april is our next vending event and i am very excited and already having stress dreams but that's okay um it's it's just my brain trying to figure out if i need to completely redesign my booth from the ground up or not um we're gonna go with a no on that one for this year but i still always humor the idea um <laughs> much to my and randy's dismay <laughs> so uh but prepping up for anime st louis oh my god guys the garden is spring is springing outside and it's amazing and if you guys want to keep up with me on that uh we do have like keep up with what's new here on our little quarter acre urban homestead um the monster vlog is our youtube channel where i post all of our gardening stuff <laughs> so gardening and cooking and different pet shenanigans and different things um also we we might be getting more baby chicks soon so i am like so nervous and excited about that and um yeah so i think i think that's everything y'all um tuesdays we are streaming from noon to five over on kick and and if we keep getting lots of custom orders from folks and then I think we'll be doing Lampwork Glass on Tuesday. Maybe. We'll see. I don't know if I'm going to have the gas for it, really. Um, but I want to thank everybody who's been placing custom orders for beads. Why is the light doing that? Um, who's been pay placing custom orders for beads. Y'all have been keeping me busy. And I am so happy to be busy. So thank you guys so, so much. Um, and then Wednesdays and Thursdays, we have... We don't stream those days. Uh, Friday, we have our... A YouTube live stream where we're, we're actually dual streaming. I'll get this straight one day. We stream from 2 until 6 on Fridays. We stream again over on Kick exclusively on Saturdays from noon till 5 and we have new tutorials every Sunday and we have our shop updates every Monday. So hopefully um, hopefully we'll catch y'all online. We'll see you over in the chat in some of those and if you follow along with any of our tutorials or use any of our materials or kits or just want to share what you're up to, be sure to do hashtag craft along with Vaughn on your social media of choice. And um, that way we can see you guys in our Friday live streams because that's I'll take a little bit of a break sometimes and go through and like, we'll go through social media posts together and I'll get to see what you guys are working on. And that, that makes social media a lot more fun for me to actually get to see what my friends are making instead of just like scrolling and the algorithm just showing me whatever is trending. And I'm like, oh yeah, but I don't really care though. But when it's a y'all, I'm like, I get so excited and y'all really help make it a party. So thank you guys. I think I'm going to get back to it. So until next time, you guys, thank you so much for being here and happy crafting. Mwah! Bye. <laughs>